just for the fact uh, all the tight ends I seen, when they got in their prime, they slowed down. From Antonio Gates to Gonzalez, like an uh, injury, if it was Antonio Gates' ankle, uh, you know, uh, I forgot what, 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 what started aggravating uh, Gonzalez. And uh, who else I put? Because my favorite tight ends is Gonzalez, Shannon Sharp, and, you know, Gronk. and Gates. This before Kelsey come to the league. I fuck with Gronk, but I was a Hernandez fan. You feel me? So, you know, people and don't Hernandez, know. Huh? Hernandez fuck. was the number one. See what I'm saying? Man, you can't say that, bro. Yeah. You can't say that, dude. Hernandez. Both of them niggas was two Her- different ice water ass niggas. Look, like, because I'm a, let me tell you why Hernandez. It wasn't no one. They played look, them both at the same let me time. Tell you why Hernandez was number one. Hernandez could play receiver too. That's what I'm trying to tell you, brother. This is why Hernandez. That don't was, mean you be, you number one because you because you smaller than Grant. Say this is why I think Hernandez was better than Grant. Man, come on, Gronk man. couldn't move like him. What that mean? Gronk were, can't move like a lot of people. And, and when they was together, he was targeted more. Hernandez. Can Gronk move like Shannon Shaw? No. But he's still better than him. I don't know about that. Because Shannon Shaw wasn't man, in the league. Man, Shannon Shaw something. would tell you Gronk better than him, though. No. They wasn't throwing the ball as much as they throw it now when Shaw was in the league, bro. They that got to do with the tight end. A tight end wasn't getting a hundred catches. Gronk ain't getting a hundred catches. But Kelsey's getting a hundred catches. That's Kelsey, nigga. Gronk catching ninety balls. I ain't say Kelsey. Gronk catching Gronk. ninety balls and shit. <laughs> I ain't say Kelsey. Kelsey on some on some different shit. He a he a unicorn. And he ain't. I can't say he can move like Shannon. He just different though. He, he Kelsey a different different dude, bro. Kelsey gonna go down the best ever. He might be the best ever right now, matter of fact. And I used to argue the point that no nigga ain't fucking with Gronk, woo woo. But Kelsey gonna have the yards to back it up, the stats to back it up. He probably got it now. Right. That's all I used to be telling. C, Is he like what? when me and C had this conversation? Kelsey is short. I ain't sure because I think Kelsey like. Six four or something. No, I think they, they 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 said it. Uh, Kelsey is six five two. Uh, he bigger than Sharp. Yeah, they listen, sharp like six they two. Act, Cause he Shannon skip skip, skip ask skip ask Shannon this morning. He like he like Kelsey is about six four two forty eight. Shannon, which you was? And Shannon said I was six something woo woo two twenty eight. And Skip was like yeah, he moves like he bigger than that. Yeah, look, and 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 Skip like he moves mm-hmm. like you are faster. Uh that when Shannon even said it like, yeah, he moved just as fast as me, but he's 20 pounds heavier. Right. He he's agile. I think he may be a tad bit more agile than Shaw. That, I think Shaw was a little it. faster than him. Like straight line shit. Straight line shit, yeah. But, you know. He said that uh, Kelsey more agile than them. See, Kelsey played tight end probably the best you can play. Right. Like, how he play. It ain't about, oh, I'm just fastening you. Or, oh, no, this nigga, IQ is on 100. 100. Don't take big hits. He the truth, bro. They got Pat Mahomes. It's how Andrew Reed just told his team. And that's crazy right there. Like, I think that's fire and that's crazy. And Reed just told his team, look, don't take this shit for granted with Pat Mahomes now. We really seeing some special shit. Right. <laughs> like, like, imagine Bill Belichick saying that about Tom. Ain't no fucking way. You know what I'm saying? No, Tom, regular name, quarterback. You know, but Bill a little fucked up with it. <laughs> Bill. <laughs> but Andy, Andy Reed told his team, man, look, don't take this shit for granted. Like, you know, when Pat Mahomes, not last right. night, but... The week before that, he done spent off a nigga. Did, he done did the, the move. He said, yeah, bro, I've been practicing my side still playing basketball. I just hit him with that one. Then he threw it in the end zone for the touchdown. Now, speaking on that, I remember, on, I remember you telling me this. See, like, 
he, we not saying he's the best ever because, you know, his resume can't put him as the best ever yet. But do you still feel like he's the best you ever seen at the position so far? You still feel that way? Pat Mahomes? Yeah. Yeah, him and Aaron Rodgers, the best I ever saw. And Pat Mahomes doing shit. <laughs> Man, Pat, Pat Mahomes different, Mahomes bro. Is Michael Jordan of football. Hey. He different, bro. Man, Kelsey said he the Houdini of this era. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> He's a different cat. That's who Mike was at this time. That's who he you is. got the light in the cup. You got one in here, Wolf? But yeah, bro, we seen special shit with Pat. Yeah, but he the truth, bro. And uh, speaking of this NFL shit too, bro, man, gotta give him his flowers, bro. Jalen Hurts, bro. Jalen Hurts, dog. Five and oh. Man, but all right, all right. I feel you. Jalen Hurts, he had two touchdowns. He had, I don't know, bro. It's like, is he really doing, is he... Is he that good like that? You yeah, know, this, you know, I, this like, the question I, I want to ask. Like, no. Because uh, he ain't better than Josh. He ain't doing shit new. Josh Allen looked at like the best quarterback ever less to see You know what I'm saying? Them fucking dimes he was no. dropping from 100 yards out. He had a 98-yarder. He had a perfect 60-yarder with dude and the, with Davis and the, the defense a nigga had it. Man, Josh Allen like that. Now, look. To, to the Josh Allen thing, now this was some guys feel Ooh, like it's in the cup. This was some, I unlocked it if you want to grab it. This was some guys feel like uh, think I want it. Oh, I ain't even know. <coughs> I thought she didn't see it, but okay. it's all good. But yeah, bro, like uh, so if you feel like Patrick Mahomes is the best thing you ever seen from a talent standpoint at the quarterback position, then. How you feel about Allen? Because Allen looks like he's a better version of Mahomes. It, you know, it's hard to it's say. It's a difference, dude. It's a difference. Because Pat Mahomes doing more Houdini quarterback shit. Josh Allen still throwing dimes, making good reads, got nice touch on it. He running the ball, too, though. Right. He taking it's off. The, it's the acrobatic stuff. It's the side on throw. That's the Pat Mahomes shit. It's like, it's damn. The, awkward, it's the, awkward the awkwardness. He throwing left-handed left -handed passes and shit, man. Like, right. You know, so, so for me, think about when, when Mike came into the game with the spinning backwards and the shooting backwards and all of the reverses and all of the stuff that he did. It seemed and like Mahomes is Steve after. Young. The truth. See, Mahomes hit the game. Uh, Mahomes is Steve Young and Brett Favre put together. Yeah, on some shit. You yeah. know, like, I could come be Peyton Manning in the pocket today. I ain't got to take off. I think Steve Young kind of ran it a little more. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. He, he kind of was, you know, they was running Steve Young a little bit from what I remember. And it's like they don't really run Pat. Pat just, he just he athletic when he'll get last out. Last night, they did, like, three design runs for him. Oh, like, man. hut, it was designed. Some shit like they do with Allen. Sometimes where they dotting you up, we know we got the defense on their heels. They call quarterback runs for the sure, nigga. Okay. They call quarterback yeah. runs for him. Last night I seen it. He broke he broke like two of them twelve yard runs. Like, but they was designed quarterback and, runs. And so for the rest of the the rest of the quarterbacks that can be compared to him, it ends up for me just being like, okay. If all y'all about to say, who did it first? You feel me? Right. Who did it? Who did it without the influence of anybody else? And See, though, I know, because Jalen Hurts, even before he got, before he hit the NFL, he had an opportunity to see how Mahomes was playing, and said, okay. I can learn from, from that. Exactly. Everybody else coming you out know, and say, oh, I'm glad you shot. mentioned that. Exactly, bro. Look, but I feel that too, but I feel this is what Jalen Hurts uh, benefits from. To me, it's mainly Lamar Jackson because they gave Lamar, I didn't say they gave him a chance. He really should, probably should have went top three, but he went whatever he went to Baltimore, 29, 30, whatever he went. Right. But... 
They see that you can win an MVP, you can be right around the championship every year with Lamar Jackson. And I feel like Jalen Hurts, I feel like it's been, it's probably been 20 Jalen Hurts. That's how I feel. That didn't get the shot. That just didn't get the shot to somebody to believe in him. Somebody to, fuck that, we going with Jalen Hurts. We going with Tyrod Taylor. Like, you know, I we going forget with. forget this, we, dog. They got one guy that I compare to Jalen Hurts that at his house, on the couch right now. But I remember Ray Lewis, Ed Reed, all these people was furious when Baltimore gave uh, picked up uh, Joe Flacco. Now, it worked out for him. They won the Super Bowl and everything. Troy Smith from Ohio State. Mm. Troy Smith probably was better than Jalen Hurts, but didn't get the shot. They wasn't ready for it yet. Troy Smith was before Russell Wilson. Troy Smith was supposed to be the first Russell. But didn't get a shot. Mm. And they had an outcry behind that. That that locker room was divided at one time. Them dudes was mad behind that. Behind Troy Smith. And then he went to Frisco and it happened to him again. I want to say they went with Alex, Alex Smith, Smith yep. over him. I see what I do say Jalen Hurst do got. That's probably top notch out of the good quarterbacks that's similar to him. He IQ. can run that bitch like a running back. And, and got the IQ to get down and not get hit. I think he's special in that category. You can run him with being a well, man. Look, we ain't running him and he just going put his head down and run over people. No, we got good running, good run pass options where he getting that slide, getting out of bounds. You know, Come they'll, on, man. they'll you run him at like the Troy one or two. Man. I fucked with Troy Smith, boy. Troy, Troy Smith, Smith was cool. a dog, brother. And he was a, he he got the arm. <laughs> You know, Jalen Hurts could throw it around. Troy Smith but was. not like him, Troy Smith. Troy Smith like was a, in the pocket, nigga. Like, you ain't just thinking about running the ball with him. But now, you know. And I asked this question the other day. Is Hurts going to be better than Russell? And it's, I say yes, dog, because his work ethic. All I seen that dude do, first when he was at Alabama, Hut run behind the line for two, three years. All right, took him out the game, put this other nigga in. I'm about to transfer. I'm, I'm start. My people are gonna pay for it. Every summer, I'm going to the quarterback guru in California. I went to Oklahoma. Only reason why I ain't went to Heisman, Joe Burrow. I finished second in the Heisman. The rest is history. I don't make that decision to leave Alabama and go to Oklahoma. I'm in the NFL playing wide receiver or something. Right now, if he don't go to Oklahoma, he don't even get a chance at quarterback. That's what people don't even realize about the dude, bro. He don't even get a chance at quarterback, bro, if he don't go to Oklahoma. And he went to Oklahoma and still went third round or something. <coughs> I'd have said it wasn't. It wasn't. See, the Russell word that this was probably fire, fire, fire. But what happened to him? You know what I'm saying? He laid up there, hooked up with a little girl. He not, he, he not, he not better than uh, Russ, bro. I don't know about that, see. I don't know about and, that, see. Because <laughs> guess what? I'm going to go out there and say it. He a better athlete off the top. So now, oh, yeah. yeah, he a better athlete hands down off the top. Now, if I get this shit down packed and really, woo, 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 I'm a student of the game already. All I do is get better. It looks like he's going to be better than Russell. I can't say that right now. The trajectory that he's on, he's going to be better than Russell, though. He's going to be better than Russell, though. I just, I, I just feel like he ain't going to get his props like he that good because he running the ball. You know what I'm saying? I just don't no, think he's he leading the league in passing. If he got mean, the most passing yards in the league. He's number one and so. number two right now. I think yeah, he changed. was number one and number two. He's slinging it. So, because that was Brian Clark. That was, that was Clark argued. No, don't try to label him a woo, 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 woo. Right now, in five games, he's up there with the elite, passing the ball. He top three in the league in all passing categories. You know what I'm saying? Slinging still, nine. That's like Lamar. Lamar up there, too. But who, ain't nobody about to say you can throw this bitch like, like the, the real deal niggas. You see what I'm saying? He just, you're not going to get your just due because you Lamar. Jalen Hurts, same thing. You're not... Yeah, if you running this bitch you all day, you must say hear what Brian, Brian Clark said about Russell. 
Yeah, he ain't fucking with us. Look, Ryan Clark, like, shit, he Ryan, ain't no all-time great. Uh, nothing. Ryan Clark, like, ball you head behind that leads in the boom. First of all, when you first come to the league, you was a game manager. Damn. Jalen Hurts just got in the league. Ain't no fucking game manager. He went in these games. Jalen Hurts is not game manager. It took Russell... Two years to develop into though. himself. Yeah, because look, they t- he wasn't no game man. It's just that's why, why, why give him the, give him the uh, listen, the offense when we got leads in the doom and you're a rookie. Tell you. you know, like why do that? Why Ru- be like you? The games through? wasn't put in Russell's hand early, Damn. like them these games been put in Hurts' hand though early. He, he been putting that man hand. He the quarterback. The defense balling. It ain't like, but they averaging thirty five a game. They averaging thirty four a game, brother. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you, go, go to the scores. You know, yeah, thirty eight against uh, they, Detroit. When you Detroit when you back. round it up, bro, they scored twenty or something last week. When they you scored, round it up, they scored twenty this week, and like. When you round it off, see. I think they scored twenty something last week too. All right, all right, no, 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 no. 38, 24, 24, 29, 20. Yeah, they only had thirds one time, so they ain't in the thirds there. Where it is? They averaging about 38, 24, 24, 29, 20. <coughs> I, I I just thought they had a couple of thirty point games, but they did. But man, boy, Hurts looking like you know. I'm fucking with I'm fucking with uh I'm fucking with Hurts, dude. Does she you know? You don't you. You just gotta prove that shit. Now back to that. You gotta yeah, get gotta to them you. offs and win game. Cause if you if you if you go lose first round of shit, nigga ain't respecting that shit. You know what I'm saying? Nigga ain't gonna respect that shit like you fire like that. But like I always tell you, D, I and we get Hurts gonna win the Super Bowl I, this year. Yeah, that's he better like than that. Russ off the top. Better than a nigga who won the Super Bowl. Who won the Super who Bowl. Who been winning games year after year. Time. Had Peyton Manning crying on the sideline. Yeah, but if man. they win. 50 to 3. If they win, they You ain't have win to. that Super Bowl, man. Stop it. You ain't win that Super Bowl, Russell. I'm feeling Ryan Clout. I'm saying he done been to multiple Super Bowls. He. Yeah. And he's he, winning games. And, 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 and he did the most simplest thing you can ever do on the field. Yeah, man. That when he showed me. You feel me, man? Look, that from that day forward, that's when I lost respect for Russell. You changed that play, boy. You changed that play. You changed that play. Ain't no excuse for that. Tom Brady wouldn't have did it. Corey Dillon would have got that ball. We celebrating. Oh, no. You heard me? Brett Favre would have changed that play. Man, no. Yeah. How Steve you you Young would have changed pick, that play. Man, yeah, you about to throw a pick from the one-yard line. You, Beast, so they, Beast they Mode no just broke yard. six tackles and got you to the one-yard line. Yeah, that's that, that was the biggest part. But come on, you acting like they got no one-yard touchdown passes. You know what I'm saying? I feel like he the only starter in the league that accepted that. Man, fuck no. Man, man they, they got, they got, they got, they got the people that came out and said it, bro. Man, come on, man. Like your coach called a play. Y'all feeling good? It ain't like you think. We on the one. Exactly. I can guarantee you. I know two would have changed it. Who? Three. I'm gonna give you three. I'm putting my head on the chopping block, and we would have asked them. Brett Fall, Peyton Manning, and Tom Brady. Brett Fall would have changed it. Them three would have changed it. Brett Fall was throwing the ball, son. Peyton and Tom, yeah. They them niggas. Ben Rossiburger would have gave that bitch to the bus. You better fucking believe it. You want to look at Mike Tomlin like, huh? Come on, woo. You that bus so the bus wouldn't have got that ball. Cause that what the beast mode was, the bus. He, equivalent. 
Boy, Jerome Bettis would have got that fucking ball at the yeah, one yard line, more, bro. Was fucking, fuck, he was more of a for sure than a bus. Fuck. I don't know if he was more for sure than a bus. Yeah. For a one yard game. But you forget fucking Jerome Bettis. Yeah, you forgetting. Uh-uh. I can't let you I can't you can't do the bus that. Beesmo was a dog, but okay. we talking about the bus. Yeah, Beesmo better than the bus. I don't know about that. I do. The bus had a better career than Beast Mode. You want to go to the numbers? Man, fuck no. All right, hold up. Don't disrespect the fuck bus. No. First battle Hall Mode. of Fame with Jerome Bettis. Man, everybody go to Hall of Fame in NFL, man. But I'm just saying, Lynch ain't first ballot. Jerome Bettis, first ballot. Hall of Fame. Hey, you know Lynch ain't going to be first ballot. Nah. Jerome Bettis. Hold How you up, know Bettis. Lynch ain't going to be first ballot, dude? I don't think so. I don't, I don't think, I don't think Lynch gonna be first batter. You hear me? I don't know if Jerome better was first batter. He probably was, but selected number ten overall in the nineteen ninety three draft. You feel me? Look, what he, what he, what he, six, six time Pro Bowler at the position. You feel me? Ninety three, ninety four, ninety six, ninety seven, oh one, oh four. He wasn't better than. Jerome didn't Marshawn Lynch. Huh? That's two niggas we saw. We we ain't see Jerome early, early, early like really there, but we saw a good bit of Jerome career. I done saw a good bit of his career. He's not better Thir- than thirteen thousand six hundred rushing yards. Played. He did it a a good amount of time at a high level. I ain't gonna knock Coming him on the that. season. And he did it when they was running the ball way more. Like you know, like, like when it was when it when it, when it was hard, nigga was stuffing the boxes, bitch, knowing you about to run. You know what I'm saying? Knowing you about to run. Come on, man, it's the bus. Let me see how many Lynch had, how many yards Lynch had. Nah, can't fuck with the bus. Ten thousand for your career. The bus had that thirteen thousand. That ain't got to do. Yeah, he just played long. I mean, it's, it's running backs. Fuck. How many games? Five time Pro Bowler. I know Marshawn was a better running back than Jerome at the boat highest peak. Marshawn better. I don't know about that though. I feel, I feel like Marshawn was a better running back than him. He was more mm. of the team. See, I feel like dude had the luxury of being in Pittsburgh. No, dude was in in, 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 in in the LA Rams. I mean uh the Rams. He was in Pittsburgh for ten years. Or no, I'm talking about he made his name in the Rams. Who? The the bus. He got the No, even... sir. Yeah. Yeah, see when he played for him. Uh-uh. He got drafted by the Rams. I know that, but he didn't make a name with the Rams. Yeah, was, that's why he, he made his name. name. Fuck, he was the top ten pick. He was good. I don't remember him at Pittsburgh. Yeah, you don't remember I had no fucking Rams. Man, yeah, he played three seasons for the Rams, yeah. and then got traded to Pittsburgh. Yeah, yeah man. How many years at Pittsburgh? He played about ten years at Pittsburgh. Ninety six to oh five, yeah, ten years. You know, I rookie know. of the year in ninety three, comeback player of the year in ninety six because he got hurt in ninety five. Two time first team. All pro. Marshawn got two. First team, all pro. I seen that too. And he got six Pro Bowls, and Marshawn got five. Five. But he got 3,500 3, more yards than Marshawn. And yeah, Marshawn ain't played long, ain't played on 13 years. And if he did, you know, he was just on. Yeah, he what? played from 93 to 05. And a couple of them years, he ain't even played like fucking with the Raiders and, you know, whoever else he was playing for right quick. Bills, he was going off. Seattle, he, he played going 12 off. years. Marshawn played 12 years. Two of them years, he ain't even played though. You know what I'm saying? And. That is Mr. Year 2, 9 to 5. 
Got comeback hurt. player of the year. You know what I'm saying? I think Marshawn missed some time being hurt too previously before just them last dumbass years Marshawn had. You know what I'm saying? <coughs> yeah, dude. that's a good argument though. Yeah, I mean, what, I think, what? Yeah, I can't. I, I I take Marshawn in, but that was a good. That's a good comparison. Him and Jerome better. They both <laughs> iconic from the running back position. But uh. Yeah, Saints. Did they think? I like uh Dalton, but like C said, he been on taste for me. You heard me? Like, just put dude in. <laughs> dude, make it happen. That's why I was him. getting that with the hurt shit. <laughs> no, I just think it's harder to beat teams who got niggas who can run the ball at quarterback. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be harder to throw this bitch and all that because you ain't Peyton Manning. But when it come down to it, it's third and four, third and five. You gotta he play the whole the field. You gotta play the whole field, man. Boop, boop, boop. You out of here. <coughs> and that's why I'm loving with Hurts, too. He taking care of the ball. He taking care of the ball. I feel like they do. Taysom Hill? I don't think so. Now, Taysom Hill don't really turn that bitch over. He, f- he was fumbling. He don't throw picks. I'm just saying. This is the thing. This is the thing with niggas like Taysom Hill. This is the thing with niggas like Taysom Hill. These coaches not going to put their head on the line with with shit like that. Like, right. you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, these coaches in and out. No job security. Right. You ain't in college. Well, like, fuck that, man. Mm-hmm. Taysom Hill, we going to. We gonna throw this bitch twenty times, and we gonna let dude create 10, 15 times and run the ball, play good D. Deep. We go. That's a good ass formula to win. But these coaching NFL shit, no, we gotta. They got dude, the dude who could throw it. You know, Sean Payton could have had the nuts and did it. Like man, fuck that. Yeah. I'm going with Taysom Hill yeah. on year. Right. And his his legacy is in can't order. Afford to do it. You know? Dennis Allen trying to, you know what I'm saying? Dennis Allen can't afford this to do that. This is second time, probably his last shot. Yeah, you know, he can't afford to just do that like that. And y'all got, uh-uh. Because I ain't even know when they had showed Dennis Allen resume the other day that he was Oakland head coach for one year. I ain't even know that. When he left us for, the, for that one year, he was Oakland head coach, but he got fired and he come and Sean Payton hired him back as the D coordinator. You feel me? Cause if you know that when he left, our defense had like wasn't good for like two, three years, bro. Our, you know what I'm saying? Was that then before our defense, after Greg Williams. After Greg Williams. Our defense wasn't good for like two years. He come back, we back top five. When Dennis Allen come back. You feel me? I don't think Dennis Allen, our defensive coordinator, on the miracle catch with Stephen Diggs. Mm. I don't think he our D coordinator that year. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. That, that probably paid the fact then why it, we fucking lost too. That, hurt that one hurt it more than the the, 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 the call to me. I mean, Both of them heard it though, yeah, but that miracle catch. We won that one. <laughs> We just needed one stop. We still had to go win that game when the call happened. You know right. what I'm saying? But, man, I heard it, bro. I heard it, boy. I remember where I was at when that happened. Did I watch the game by you? Huh? Did I watch? Did you Did you have the game by you? No, I was at uh, at Child. Well, it's called Child. No, it was called, it was Park Coach, Coach of Park. I remember, I remember I was in there, niggas hooping and hollering. We done gambled, niggas' bets done hit, niggas got the Saints. It went from winning money to losing money quick. And the Saints lose. Like, right. you thought you won just right. now? That's <laughs> the whole other way around. I'm talking about niggas dabbing each other off. I told you! Man, niggas was cutting up in there. <laughs> Ooh, that was, that was like a hard, that was a hard one. No home. See, brother, that was supposed to. Grab him in the air. That's right. it. That's couldn't it. believe we were seeing. Like, <laughs> man, that's a replay or something? I couldn't believe he didn't even touch him. He didn't even touch him. He didn't even touch him. Because it would have been fucked up. He touched him, get a penalty. Now they weighed out there. He could have kicked a field goal or something to win the game. 
I think that we was only up one or something or two or some shit. Man, that's Dude why. Let him catch the ball and give him a big hug. Give him a big old hug. <laughs> Beep. They ain't had no timeouts or nothing, bro. They was dead. Oh, it was, was, was fine enough that they could have caught that bitch and got out of bounds and kicked the field goal. It still had like it was a, that was a second or two left after field he caught. Shit, no. He caught it long. That shit don't take long. Right, that bitch was going to be like a 56. No. Where he caught it at? He caught it at like the 30 or something. He caught it like at the 30. Yeah, yeah, he did. So 50, 40, 50 40, yards. 45 yards plus 7, 52 yards. Yeah, 52 yards. Nigga knocking that down. Nigga knocking that down. That's a layup, boy. Oh, that's a layup in the dome. 52. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You've been layup. going home. Yeah, that's a layup. He still would have had to be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's 52. Just like you said about the Rams. He still, we still would have had to convert. Man, that shit still hurt. <laughs> but uh, how you like the state of the Saints right now? How you feel about how we going, how we, you know? The reason why I feel good about the Saints because our division jumped. We got a chance. Yeah. Niggas ain't good. Tom Brady and them, they, what, three and two now? They barely made it yesterday, and they getting all type of help winning. The Falcons five and zero against the spreads. The Falcons, <laughs> what they is? They the only they one and four. They the only team covered every week. And, and one and four. <laughs> Record. Carolina jump. Jump. Atlanta. Matt Rule. Atlanta jump. Now watch whoever inherit that team. Saints got I'm great calling protection. it right now, boy. Whoever inherit that fucking team. But a team's been calling, man. Nigga sent me something this morning on the, on the um, IG that Buffalo just sent for McCaffrey. Wait, Buffalo what? You... Buffalo just sent for McCaffrey. You know, they done fired their coach. So uh, the team's coming at them like, man, y'all rebuilding, man. Sling everything. What's up? They getting calls now. DJ Mo, they calling for him now. They calling for their players. They said Buffalo trying to man, get McCaffrey. Boy, look. You give him that, it's over with, for sure. For sure, dude, dude going to put the jewelry on. You give him McCaffrey. Now the offense going to be all the way unstoppable. You can't stop him now. McCaffrey. Man. Yeah. Man, look, I'm cool with Winston if he healthy. I'm cool with Dalton. I like the way he runs. But I offense. like Dalton. I feel like we cool with Dalton. I mean, I feel like Winston shouldn't be... Worse than Dalton. And Dalton good to me. Dalton ain't about to come out here and just be losing games. Like, it ain't going to be because of Dalton. We lost. No. And that's to my point. I think what the Saints really, really need is a good game manager at the cornerback position. Because we can do all kinds of other things. We got good strength at wide receiver. We got good strength coming out the backfield. You know what I'm saying? All I, think, I think we too we powerful, man. We supposed to be scoring on niggas, niggas, man. Huh? I think we supposed to be scoring on niggas. Me too. <laughs> We got too much talent. We can game manage this thing and score on everybody. That's what I'm saying. Just protect the ball. You dig? Yeah, ID, ball. good. You ain't just rolling over us, you know. Now, Seattle has some. Our D going to get players. better. Our D going to get better toward the end. Yeah. Look, Alvin Kamara averaging them near fumble again. Hey, we got to take care of the football, bro. I like Olave. Yeah. How he doing? He looks like he got four touchdowns. Well, I think he's right. straight. Yeah. Well, he, he does run. Yeah. And I called that, too. I'm like, man, that still look like it's a touchdown, dog, because it was. he went to the ground holding that bitch. Even though he was out, he's still clutching them. Mm -hmm. And the dude knocked it yeah. out. After he done went down, like, he already done touched the ground with it out. Ain't You can't just knock it out after he done already secured the catch, went on the ground and everything else. No. And them bitches called that bitch a touchdown. I ain't, you know. And I think that even before you hit the ground, you had the ball. You had the thing in the two steps and actually had the ball just long enough to see. He caught it. 
No, you gotta hold it to the ground. I got honestly still though, dog. We got everything. Like we got a two headed monster. You know, Mark Ingram come in, gonna tote. No, you missing what I'm saying. Uh, like we when got. You, when you jump and catch the ball, you can jump, catch the ball, come down. They still touch down. Somebody hits you just because they mad, right? Mm-hmm. But there's a moment where when you come down, get your feet down. There's a moment where it goes from being part of the catch to the catch part is over now. And as soon as that catch part is over, it's a touchdown. The instantaneous right. moment is a touchdown. Right. So I feel that. I don't think that was it, though. that instantaneous moment, it was a touchdown before. If you would have lost that ball when he hit that ground, incomplete. Mm-hmm. For sure. Because he didn't catch it and run or He got He caught it getting right. tackled. Caught it and got hit. Boom! It just do helm and hit his shoulder. So he luckily he cussed up. I'm happy they called it right though. And he never let it go. He never let it go though. Nah. Hit the ground right quick. Boom! Held it and dude knocked it out right after the after he done touched the ground already. Mm-hmm. He still got it. Mm-hmm. Like if you don't hit it out, he's still gonna be holding, holding that bit. So yeah. it's not like the ground caused the incompletion. Right. But that'd have been incomplete for sure. Down. Uh, yeah, who we who we got this week? Sensei Joe Burrow now. Coming the to the dome. dome. And <clears throat> Chase coming home. Yeah, it's over with for your ladder mo. That boy coming home. He ain't have a big game yet. Take Man, Jamal Chase. Jamal Chase over everything this week. Dude gonna come shine, boy. Dude, dude come and shine in it that dome. It seems like it's working. Jamal come and shine. They giving Jamal Chase a whole lot of attention, bro. You know, I be on. I be watching all the games. We, yeah, they be doubling them. They be doubling them. I mean, they be they send they 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 send they got a lot of help going on. It's hard for him to really get going. And I see. I feel like it's helping slow down Cincinnati because Joe Burrow back there just you know. He's still working that bitch, but he ain't, he doing a whole lot of dinking down and but just that trying gonna to stop because T Higgins a dog. What y'all gonna keep like T Higgins gonna keep fucking y'all up then? Y'all doing yeah. that and T Higgins gone though, fucking yeah, y'all up. T Higgins banged up. Yeah, he banged you know, up. Because the fuck they ain't really scoring like there was thirty points, high twenties and shit all year last year. Now they. 20, 19, you know, 19 in every game. though. that's the good thing for at least they not just looking bad, getting the beat shit out of them. Dude, Joe Burrow still getting hit, but. Their defense look good. I can't wait to see uh, to Deshaun Watson come back, though, because Cleveland lost every game by five points or less. I feel like Cleveland is undefeated with Deshaun Watson. Hands down. They blonde, they looking like Philly. Beating the fuck out of everything. Cause Cleveland got a fucking squad, though. Like, if they gonna win a few games, they going to the Super Bowl with Deshaun Watson. I I I, I can see that really happening. Yeah, Don't let them people tough. get in. If, if, if they could get in, scary sight. It's gonna be tough, bro. That's a scary sight, brother. Cause Nick Chubb. I've been Nigga saying that he's the best him, back in the league. I, that's what I think, I, I, bro. He, he been saying that <laughs> shit, dog. I believe, nah, but he proved it to me. <laughs> he been screaming him. I'm like, man, Leonard better than that nigga, all that woo-woo-woo. But it, it was a time Leonard still was better right, than him. Right. Nick Chubb is the best back in the league for sure. Like, you can't stop him. Like, this nigga, he's in the end zone every week, 150 yards. He just... That nigga cold. And then you, know, you got Kareem Hunt, a star, Kareem Hunt, bagging him up. Bagging him up. A show dog. A nigga who led the league in rushing before is his backup. Yeah. So every time he touches, I, I, my touch is limited because the best nigga in the league in front of me. So when I get it, I got it. And they making sure he touches. Right. Like Kareem Hunt, he, he going to touch. But you know they let him line up in the slide. Yeah, he, he got to get the ball too, though. Mm-hmm. Them dudes deadly, boy. They deadly. Miles Garrett. David Clowney. Dale Pitt. 
Deshaun. Greedy Williams. Deshaun Denzel Washington. Ward. Yeah, Denzel Ward. Highest paid. Just got the money. <laughs> so when they get Deshaun back, but that's why I said, dog, I don't know, dog. They, they ain't going to let them people in the playoffs. They just, I don't know. Like, them people ain't going to. Next year, though, because this nigga, he missed 11 games, dog. So it's like he got six more games out. What they, what they two and three, huh? Boy, the people going to be in them odds, boy. They two and three. He got six more games I don't left. see how they going to lose. If they go three and three, what when they going to be? Hold up. I'm just trying to see. They two and three right now. If they go three and three in the next six weeks, they gonna be five and six when Deshaun Watson come back. All right. So Deshaun Watson is seventeen weeks. When you're five and six, you gonna have sixteen. I mean, you gonna have six games left when Deshaun Watson come back. Just say you five and six with six games left. Deshaun Watson had to go undefeated for them to get in. Yeah, Deshaun Watson had to come six and zero, and that's he could do that, right? But not and if I, they go they, four and two in the next six weeks. They even gonna get in. They too good. They good with Brissett. They good. They gotta figure out a way to. The defense gotta play a little better. You know. No man, dude, stupid ass, keep turning the ball over when he get down there, man. Brissett, man, he's selling them out. Well, he, they just he, got to the one yard line. He threw a pick and they just threw it straight. I said, man, yeah, dog, but still, they defense is holding niggas to seventeen person shit every week. Ah, the offense can't score. Do score every possession. That's they both score. Oh, they both score. Dude just threw a pick at the last time. They still could have won. They missed the field goal at the end of the game to win the game. It was down two. That touchdown would have made him go up back seven or something. That's right. They threw the pick. Dude, and it was down one, I think. And then they missed the field goal, huh? They could have won. They, they, they. It was down one when he threw the pick, the Browns. And them dudes went and got a, uh, a field goal. They was up one or down one, something like that. And yeah, man, um, wanted wanted to touch up on LSU, bro. What's going on, bro? They played. What's going people. on in Baton Rouge, bro? They played them people yesterday. I mean, I bet Tennessee ain't them people. Yes, they is. They ain't them people. We gonna see if you them this. people this week. Yeah, <laughs> they, show they coming to town. And uh, you know, I still don't even play with them. Papa people. Bell coming Tennessee, to town this week. Tennessee gonna be them. Bama. Tennessee gonna beat them people. Gonna beat Bama. Gonna beat Bama. Ooh, this that's your upset this week because we ain't get picks last Man. week. Well, he gave you he one. Upset to me. They just ranked number one Tennessee with their rank. Number eight. Oh, I thought eight. it was like five or something, but maybe eight. They got the best quarterback in the country, arguably. But he he looked like he right. He looked like he playing in the NFL. They Dude, a dog. He a dog. Fifth year senior, something like twenty four years old, but we gonna see if you ready this week. You, you see what he's doing, everybody. He ain't doing. I mean, he he he, he got it, but man, I don't judge ahead. that game from the other day. LSU, man. What you mean? He doing this every week? <laughs> every week, he got to be the Heisman. Um, you know, I don't front think runner. they could beat Bama. Bama. I just see, see LSU Bama, just Bama, had Bama it that was on the platter. What, the Bama don't look better than Tennessee? How they don't? They barely winning games. They barely won against Texas A&M. <coughs> what you mean? They just, no, man. Yeah, they barely won against Texas A&M. They fuck shit up, too. Don't get it twisted, man. Nah. I they bet you Tennessee, I bet you Tennessee getting like 10 perms. I mean, they Bama. I don't know what the line is. They're going to show you. They're going to show you. They get seven. They get seven at home. Oh, man. They get seven at home. Well, they respecting them when they are. They respecting Tennessee. They respecting them. They have Tennessee number six. Number three against number six. Tennessee, you over there with Georgia.
at Rocket Top, huh? That's going to be a good one. But, man, yeah, back to LSU, man. Brian Kelly and them, LSU look like they don't practice nothing. You watch LSU game, like, man, what the fuck they been working on? Some time, what? What the fuck? I been, the fuck? What we been practicing, bro? Seems like we just spread people out, hut, look for one read, and he out. take off. Yeah, what the fuck? Like, what we doing, brother? We can run some plays. Y'all should have just went with the freshman, dog. Number one pass in the country, man. Walker Howard. Should have just started him up and went with him. He throwing that bitch way better than dude. Dang it. And we stuck with Brian Keller, too. <laughs> Ten years, 100 million. <laughs> yeah, man. We don't know if the game passed him by or not. I don't know what's up with Brian Keller like that, but... It's better doing this thing. Chip. That's the Kelly. Everybody knew. They started that shit. Got everybody running to the line right yeah, now. Yeah, he yeah. he reinvented the whole college oh, yeah. football. Man, that's crazy. Nigga, he Alabama did. do it now. Nigga, after a play, Bama running to the line. He invented that shit. No huddle. Like, the no huddle, period. Like, we ain't. We're never going yeah. to the huddle. Yeah. We already trained. We giving you, we got the signs and shit. They're the one who created that. The signs and shit on the sideline. That's cool. Them when the play didn't, over with. people didn't win no chip. They ain't win it, dog. They lost to Cam. Damn. Cam oh, Newton, man. dog. That's, That's the only crazy. reason why he ain't winning. And they fought Cam them. You know, like, it ain't like they fucked them up. Like, you know what I mean? It was, it was a That's good crazy. game. I feel like that system... Damn, that bitch deserve a ring, like, you Yeah, know that saying? system was fire, bro. That bitch was innovative, like, everybody got to fuck with it. Everybody got to fuck yeah, with it. Yeah, so that. That, was, that was this shit transferred to now. Niggas is running, they was running plays. I won't say, like, six seconds into the next play. Hut or something like some shit. They, them bitches were they. Marcus Mariota. Yeah, Marcus Mariota. Uh, DeAndre the and the black black yeah, mama. <laughs> and but no, you know who was the man now? Uh, La Michael up. James. Michael James. That's who Ooh, was the man. Like, man. Uh, that whole La Run. He, up, he was running the man running. over there. La Michael James was the man over there, brother. He had the coolest, like, he was the man over there. See, when he was the running back, that shit was running fluently. I see. <laughs> you had man, to be SEC to stop that shit. Uh, Reggie Bush and that shit. Because there was some, not, there was on some. Out the shotgun shit, shit USC, right. but they wasn't. Well, Reggie Bush would have been in some shit like, like that. that. Man. And that's why UCLA doing their thing. Nah, boy. They might win the Pac-12. Talking about USC. I might have to take them against USC if they play. Dude, solid. They look quarterback solid, too. The left, the, uh, left D- hand. DTR. Now, he ain't lefty, he right. He right, he right handed. All right. He already been there five years, too. Yeah, he'll feel your senior like, <laughs> like dude from Tennessee. Mm-hmm. He been there five years. I watched it when they played Washington. He the left handed one, I think. Walt well, Penix. Well, well, he nice. I like him. Dude, dude cool. just outplayed him. He come from him. Indiana. Dude, just outplayed him. UCLA, they was. He leading the nation in passing yards. Penix. Washington. Yeah, Washington, dude. Man, he nice. But, uh,. Chip Kelly, man, yeah, that shit he started. Revolution. UCLA look like Revolution. they gonna get to the playoffs, man. Yeah, UCLA looking like they got to be USC. Yeah, man, that's it. You U- know. I would say they look better than USC right now. They do, but USC defense look better. Like USC ain't niggas ain't just scoring right, on them. Right, right, right. They right. games be low scoring. Like right, they, yeah, they, the offense just ain't where they need to be. be. But most likely. They gonna get it right. Yeah, offense, they eventually. got a D, but that quarterback Caleb, Caleb Wood, yeah, yeah, you know, top uh, five. He like Cam Newton. Yeah, I mean, they gonna they he gone. He gone. Good job, man. 
Oh yeah, the local. We had skipped over the local, man. Yeah. Carl Rowland. Carl Rowland. What they did, brother Martin? Carl Cantina Road. <laughs> they showed them too. Yeah, showed them too. Called out the dogs. You feel me? Showed them. And you know, Carver fought one on Eastern Saturday. Lost on the Bible snap. So in overtime. So how Cali Lee feel about? How you think they feeling about that shit? Like. I know they're going to run him out. They're going to run him out the district. Cam and this bitch and just beat Listen, the fuck brother. out of everybody. We already know. Listen, this year going to be over with. We're going to be chilling in the summer. <laughs> yeah, breaking news. Carl <laughs> is in the district where she out met. <laughs> West <laughs> Jeff. <laughs> the public school district, man. They're going to run the fuck out cup, boy. Yeah. They're going to run the fuck out cup. Out that district, bro. It's called gonna be they they go they gonna fuck it up, bro. They gonna fuck that uh, they gonna fuck that up. Because it's bad right now. As long as they got that app one shit and call is considered a select and call got a bus that go in every neighborhood in New Orleans, they gonna have all the players. Sometimes when the newspaper telling you you only want your children to go to these two public schools. Warren Easton and Cup. You feel me? That's why them people, because I was talking to a coach. I don't want to say the Pacific coach, but I was talking to a high school football coach, and he was telling me the reason why they put Warren Easton in that 5A playoff is because they got that ninth grade academy now across the street from the school. They got a whole nother building now. It's like, no, y'all got the talent. Y'all belong in here. So basically, they're just getting Warren Easton ready to move up anyway. Warren Easton about to go to 5 -8. That was all this about. They got a new ninth grade academy across the street. So them 500 students that the ninth graders that they used to have, 600 ninth graders or whatever they used to have in the school, that made more room for the big school because the ninth graders crawled the street. So they enrollment about to go up. But to me, they wasn't supposed to be in it this year. A 4A school got to go in a 5A playoff. You feel me? But a coach told me that they doing them that because their enrollment then went up. You feel what I'm saying? But it was just, they, it went up after they did all the listings in the place, the district places and all that. You feel me? But. Yeah, bro, that's cold. It, Warren Easton, them got to go in a 5 -8 playoff. So for the playoffs, like, we can get Warren Easton, St. Oh, first round. So I'm saying Warren Easton, Rumble, first round. Warren Easton, brother Martin. You know what I'm saying? First round. Caught Warren Easton, first round. So... This was the year Eastern finally thought they was going to be able to get to the playoffs and they had to worry about a call. And the people said, no, yeah, I'm right back in there with them. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> yeah, right back in there with them. Yeah, and uh, Zachary came on TV this week. Zachary was on ESPNU. They played against Woodlawn. They blowed them out. To me, that's the top program in the state. Zachary, but guess what? We not even gonna get a call Zachary championship. They go in two different brackets. Zachary going to public school and Carl going to select. You see what I'm saying? So you still taking away the true championships. Y'all taking away the true championships, bro. That's bad, bro. We got to give our picks to yeah. <clears throat> Since we on the college already, you know, uh, C. Gaya, yeah, Tennessee. I got to pick Tennessee. I like Tennessee with the point. You know, and I ain't, I ain't with going against Bam and shit. I don't even play that. I don't, I just go, I just pick another game to gamble with. But from what I see, you know, that's gonna be a good game. Y'all know how I bet I be. I'm I, I go to controversial shit, but this just how I'm coming. I got upset for you. Florida State.
plus the three and a half against number four Clemson. Florida State put themselves back on the map with this win. The spread telling you. Number four, three and a half. Number four Clemson at, at Florida State, unranked Florida State, three and a half. Florida State, certified lock Saturday. Florida State. Clemson ain't been looking good, dude. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Number four. Clemson. Florida State good, dude. They, what they lost to uh, Wake Forest? Yeah, I think they lost to Wake Forest, and um, that's it. Yeah, I, I think they only got one loss. I think they only got one loss, yeah. I like them three and a half with Florida State against Clemson. That's my. So, boy, has got two home dogs. Two home dogs. Okay. Tennessee, they're going to be ready out there, boy, for battle. That's a college atmosphere, bro. It's different, bro. It's really different. It's hard to go in somebody's building and beat them. Very hard. When you two good teams, like, that ain't, that ain't the easiest thing. My NFL pick, dude. Mm-hmm. Damn, how the Buffalo KC game not the Sunday night game? Is Dallas and Philly the Sunday night? And mm-hmm. they got some good game next week. Man, they got some good game, boy. But look, off hand right now, my first pick I'm going to give you, and I fuck with the other team. But. Vikings got too. Vikings got too much talent. Minnesota minus the three against Miami. That's one of my picks. Minnesota minus three against the Dolphins. On the road, giving three. You know, but I just feel like the Vikings better than them. That surprised me. I didn't know if Minnesota four and one. People four and one. I thought they lost a couple Me games. Me too. I ain't. I ain't think they was four and one. They so four and one. Yeah, them bitches four and one. This just might be Minnesota. Yeah, boy. With Justin Jefferson, Dalvin Cook, Cook Thielen. Bro. They they coming like that on the offensive end. They and defense, patting them been balling them. You know, defense. I got it. They got it. They got. They got two certified best back there. Mm-hmm. Smith and Pat. They thinking back there. They got niggas to say, uh uh-uh. uh. Oh, he about to come right there. Uh, yeah. You see what I'm saying? You know, that's like two Ray Lewis. That's, that's like Ed Reed and Ray Lewis. You, you know, you, they got two vets on the field, dog, back there in the secondary. They going to see shit before it's coming. Yeah, dog, Minnesota locked this week. They going to beat Miami. And Minnesota... They can't be losing. Minnesota won't win the division. I had picked them to win the division anyway over Green Bay. They got to keep on winning, too. And another one I like, yeah, they coming off a big win, just beat the fuck out Detroit and everything. I like Cleveland at home. to get it together. They're going to beat the Patriots. Cleveland minus three. They're going to find a way to beat the Patriots with that D. They're going to get the Daniel Jones at home. Oh, Mike Jones ain't playing. That. He heard you he may come back next week. Mike Jones, it was with a backup nigga beat the piss out of Detroit. Yeah, Cap or some shit. Hat yeah, with Cap. Gabby, some shit. And Gabby, yeah. whatever his name is, man. I ain't betting with I Detroit. Like the bed, Ever no more. <laughs> Fuck no. Fuck man. no, that's a wrap. Hey, this is what I, I like. And I think these people are going to be hard to beat week in and week out. Full nine, bro. <laughs> yeah, they, uh, Full nine, man. Jabbar man. going Best back. You league. know he's supposed to be Atlanta coach and shit. Shanahan going to beat the fuck. You know him and Arthur Blaine, boy. They, yeah. They're giving Atlanta five and a half right now in Atlanta. Frisco. They remind, I mean, they remind me of the, the, the teams that just go Tabacoba, to the Super Bowl. Going back to Atlanta. 
with playmaking. Got Debo who can make a play at any time. Greg Kittle. George Kittle. To me, Jimmy, Jimmy a good quarterback, bro. He ain't Deshaun Watson or no Pat Mahomes, but Shanahan system, he gonna, he gonna throw this ball and be all right out here. They gonna run the ball. They got Shanahan, first of all. They got Shanahan. He just a genius. Like, he just know how to maneuver with this shit. And they defense top notch. They got the new uh, Troy Palomalu back there. Dude, cold, the safety with the hell. Look just like Palomalu. He jumping over piles. He picking shit, running it back. He smacking shit. They got both in them niggas. Like, they got a top tier defense. Dude, Cole, number 29. With Shanahan, man. Yeah, they're going to be hard to beat every week, too. Marcus Mariota, they, they were just practicing against Trey Lance. I'm pretty sure they're going to, man, they're going to beat the fuck out the folk, uh, Atlanta Falcons this weekend, man. That's a lot. <laughs> That's a lot. The line going to, it's five and a half now. I, I, it'll be seven, seven and a half by the time Sunday <laughs> comes. <laughs> You got to take good. that nut. They too good, though. They got the Dallas. I like. I said, bro, night. I like Lamar this week too. As good as the Giants been playing, hey, I think that's gonna be a. T- I think it's gonna be a good game. Cause, just because of the defense, like. Right. But I like Lamar to pull away. Who you like in that Dallas Philly game? That's the Sunday Philly. night game. Cause Philly still know this the game they got to show. All the other shit. This the game right here. This the one that yeah, had division. I ain't do nothing that not what y'all gonna say now if I come do everything I've been doing on Dallas D. Far as hurts. Get this bitch done and come. That's why I feel that's gonna be a good game. Come score 28 on Dallas D. Come score four touchdowns on Dallas D. Shit, shit. That's what I wanna see. Now if he do that, they the real deal, cause Dallas got the best D in the league. I got all the D's I seen. I ain't lying, boy. Dallas got the best D in the league, though. With Micah Parsons. Yeah, bro. They triple teaming that dude. De- Demarcus Lawrence, bro. De- your boy, De- Lawrence, bro. Dude, dude, them nice, bro. Yeah, they nice. You know Diggs, DBs, your boy, Calvin Joseph from LSU. Dude, yeah. them, man, dude, them out there. Yeah, man. But, yeah, um. How long is that supposed to be up? They say he could come possibly back play this week. week. I think they're going to keep Cooper Rush out there. Because why not? We don't want to show feeling that. Yeah, yeah, we don't show feeling that. Let Cooper Rush play him this time. Dak can play him next time. You know? You know, only thing, it ain't going to be hard for Dallas, but Cooper Rush go out there and beat him. You know, they're going to have a few people. Oh, Cooper Rush should just keep the job. But come on, man. If Dak getting forward or something mean to you. Yeah, hey, boy, about, about just to put like you back that. Out there. What what they did to Drew Bledsoe was unheard of. Ain't nobody think this was the second to last pick in the draft. Tom Brady, straight garbage to the world. Like for, you know, mm-hmm. they ain't behind the scenes. They don't see that this nigga the real deal. You know, like these people see, brother, the first man to get a hundred million dollars. Bill Belichick set him down, and then look. Tell you what's crazy that they I watched Skip and Shannon the other day. I ain't even know this. This the nuts. This why Bill Belichick the best ever. This the nuts he got. AFC title game that year, right? Brady go down. A uh, ankle. They losing the game and everything. Blesso come in. When? They, we going to the Super Bowl. So everybody thinking Drew Blesso about to start for the Super Bowl. He got his job back. Bill come to that thing, boy, Tom Brady is my quarterback for the Super Bowl. <laughs> yeah. Even though they got a $100 million Down man. Here. $100 million man on the bench in the Super Bowl. They, the $100 million quarterback set the bench for the Super Bowl, brother. Healthy. Just won the AFC championship game. Set him now. And that probably was his first time coming back. Since he got hurt, Drew Bledsoe. Right. You know what I'm saying? Because Tom was yeah, that, that was his year. Th- yeah, that was his first time starting uh, since since he well, get did back. Did he start? No, he he didn't start. He, he finished the game. He finished like, the game. Tom Brady got hurt in the first quarter. He won the game. 
That was in New Orleans too. In man. New Orleans, they thinking he about to get his job back, Tom Brady. I'm like, Lord, I did not know that happened. Yes, Lord. Yeah, before we get out of here and get a quick NBA, we gone, man. But um, you know, ain't much shit with the NBA. Well, NBA, you got Steph and LeBron first yeah, night. Yeah. yeah. You know what I'm saying? Stephen LeBron first it, night. It looked like the Nets gonna be. Yeah. I like the new look Clippers. Man, I NBA like the John like Wall Clippers. You hear me? Like that. I Pelicans like Denver. Hard. Denver tough. You know. We tweaking Man, for the NBA. Lamelo them ball. It started seven days. By the time it's be out, it probably be out in three, four days. You know, the um, the NBA. The NBA start on the 18th. Yeah. October 18th, you got, I forgot who the other game, you got the Lakers in, I think Boston and Philly, huh? I think it's something like that. It's something like that. I think the Pelicans start with Brooklyn or something. That might be the next day, the 19th. No. Everybody looking good. NBA look like it's going to be ready. People going to be ready to play. Yeah, Philly and Boston. That what it is. Philly and Boston play first, and the Lakers and Golden State play second. Golden State giving six at home. Boston giving three and a half at home. I like them beating them. I like Philly. Philly at full strength going to be hard to beat, brother. And B coming into the year, the healthiest he been coming into the year his whole career. Even though he his health was pretty good last year, but last year he you was know coming off I, an injury. Right, right now, now he's all the way one hundred percent in B. So you think they tan? I think Boston tandem may be just a tad bit better than Philly tandem. Maybe may be. and be the best player. He, right, he but right. Harden. I think hard, I think Jalen Brown and Tatum is is better than Harden right now. They say he lost thirty pounds or something, man. You hear me? He don't. like right now. Now when Harden was scoring his thirty five a game and they all say that, he looked back, James, bro. He can he can do that, but Jalen Brown, I mean, them, them niggas, they young, they, bro. They, they young prime right they now. They got deep, bro. They young. They young prime. They gonna kill you. Period, James. How he gonna kill you? You know, he gonna they gonna go to Tear work both time. He gonna kill. They gonna kill some every night. What did they add though? They ain't need nothing. They, they still got Al Harper and shit. They went to the they went to the chip last year. Right. They went to the chip. What about our boy, Marcus Smart? Now what? Home team. Zion. Yeah. Man, we looking like we gonna be like that. We gonna be hard to beat night in night like out. That. Uh, one man said we um, finishing top three in the West for his picks. Got us top three. Got us better than Denver. Had us better than something like. I don't see why we wouldn't be ahead of like Dallas and shit. Niggas who got one man armies and shit, you know. Got us Not in front of the Lakers. They got us better than the Lakers. One dude like. Pelicans gonna have a better team than the league. I think they had Clippers, Golden State, and us finishing third in the West. Yeah. They had Clippers and Golden State, one and two, Pelicans three. Coming out the West. Yeah, I can't wait the basketball to start. Cause Zion looks so good. Zion looks look too good, bro. We gotta we gotta Whip though, dog. Like I, I gotta go get a season package, bro. I ain't, man. Before them bitches, for for motherfuckers go to jumping on, and it's only eighteen thousand seats. I got it. Yeah. Shit, niggas. Oh, my season started. I just get the little package. Yeah, I got a good go game go. package. Cause once they go to winning, winning for real, and niggas see it, you ain't gonna be able to get in the game. I gotta get on that ASAP. Yeah, like you said, the season yeah, here. What you mean? It's there. We got Zion, but we up there. That shit been. He been selling tickets. And Zion playing. I said Zion playing. Them people been in my inbox. Hey, baby, we gonna sell them tickets. You got the package? I ain't get it. Uh-uh. Cause I ain't been. What is like twenty five hundred for the it. season? The whole season depends. I don't get the whole season. 
I get the good game, the best good game package. It's like twelve games or something. That's what I do, you know. And you know, you will get your same little seats for them twelve games. The Lakers, the Golden State game, you know, all them games. Yeah, it's it's hard to go to all them. Yeah, it's forty yeah. some home games. Yeah, so I don't, you know. Even with the twelve game, I couldn't make them all. I couldn't even make them all. You know, basketball, I was coaching all that shit. But I should probably playing. I'm going to just know I'm going to make the games I can make. Because I don't be tripping going to any game. Me, when it's all right and ain't got nothing to do tonight, I'm going to be played. Some people might not want to go to the Charlotte game, but yeah. CD want to go see LaMelo Ball. Yeah. Right. I'm going to do it. We go to the Utah game. All right, fuck. Who at Utah? Not nah, shit. I'm going to go oh, check they it out. That's where you do got three Colin years. Colin Sexton. Colin Sexton. Yeah, you over there now. Colin Sexton over there now. I'm going to get Le- LeBron come down. I'm in there. I'm fucking with LeBron. Everything. I'm, I'm, I'm in there. I'm usually going to go to uh, uh, Memphis game. John Moran now. You know, I pee with T. Usually T. Kelly for the Memphis game. Um, what the fuck? Saints? Yeah. I ain't sure preseason. We opened up on the road. Yeah, but our first real home game. It's like the 21st. The 23rd, I think. 23rd, we play Utah. Home opener. I'm in there. Okay. Right. Home opener, I'm gone. I'm going to fuck with that. We got to come out rocking. Coming out rocking, baby. Remember what day that fall on the twentieth? I'm supposed to be in Atlanta. Third, that's like, that's a Sunday. It's a Sunday. So Saints must be out of town then. But they play like Sunday, two o'clock, some shit. Their first home opener. Sunday. Saints play Monday night. Huh? Chit chat, man. Smoking sports, baby. Smoking sports, we out.